We have suffered a lot of this. Now, the situation in Polytechnic now is a situation where our workers are working in a very hostile environment. It's like you're going to war where you're going to work because you don't know where you're going to end up. There are days people have come to work and they end up in jail. I have been arrested, and right now there is a charge of attempted murder hanging over me just because trade union activity has been criminalized. The governor has seen this, and he promised that we should resume work, and a visitation panel will be set up. We expected that we'll be working in a peaceful environment pending the, the arrival of the visitation panel. But the management opened up with continuous victimization of trade union uh, ex schools and sympathizers. We have seen situations where you trump up charges, cases that have been dealt with in the past are being hooked up. Let us see ourselves more as staff of the institution and not students of the institution. So our activities as unionists must be driven from those of the students. And by so doing, we will know that very soon the matter will become solved by the grace of God. We will communicate, we will report to the House of Assembly, to the Speaker, your protests and what you want. And by the grace of God, the Speaker, as usual, in his usual character, wanting peace and stability in Lagos State, will direct that steps be taken that will solve the problem.